Hi Enzo, this is the video from the other day. I'll get it started and then I'll slow it down. So the slide control's good. Do a little movement as you come in to the front. And then we'll slow it down. Let's have a good look now. So it's squaring a little late. So and getting it covered quite quickly. So what we're obviously trying to do is when your shins are vertical, as you can see they are right now, we're trying to get that blade covered. Now the only thing I want to probably point out is there's the blade covered. Now let's see how much more the hands go up and we cover quite a bit more of the shaft. So you could actually stop lifting at that point um, and don't lift the hands any higher. The, the, the spoon's covered, don't lift any more there. I'm not opening the back too early, which is good. Uh, getting a little bit of flex on the oar, that's good, but you can see now you've got to actually bring the hands down to be able to get the blade out. And look at all the water on the shaft there. So you're working the shaft through the water rather than using the spoon as like a stake in the water, stake in the ground, picture that, and driving the boat forward from that. Uh, let's see the next one. I think you'll see very similar. Pretty good coverage locked on. So what we're trying to do is get that lock on right out the front. Same thing with the coverage of the covering the shaft there. Yep. That's good there. See, that's really good. The shins on this particular catch are basically vertical with the spoon in the water. Better depth on that occasion too, right the way through. So that's what we're trying to achieve. A uh, small check in the run of the boat on that last stroke. Okay.